Welcome everyone, I'd like to show you how to use the app library on iOS 15. So first of all, swipe to the final page on your home screen, you can tell by the page dots, and then swipe to the left one more time. Then you'll be brought to the app library. So how this works is it will group all of your applications into certain categories. These categories are set by Apple, you cannot change them, you cannot change what applications are in the folder, you can't even change the folder names. However, if you take a look, you can see app suggestions, recently added, photo and video, you get the point. So you may notice that we have these applications right here, and then we have these small apps. What on earth are those about? So if you tap on these small apps, it will bring out a pop-up view with all the applications. So this is essentially a folder inside of a folder. If you open up these larger applications, it will open up the application directly. You can also long press on these apps, choose, you know, the... Uh, 3D touch options, some applications as well you can delete. So let's say shortcuts, if I long press on this, it will give you the option to delete the application. Also, you can drag these apps to the home screen, so you can have multiple apps on your home screen. So you can see settings right here, settings is also right here, and let's have three settings apps. So I'm gonna long press and drag, and you can see we have three settings applications on our home screen. If you ever want to remove one of these, uh, you know, um, uh, settings, you just long press, and then just tap on remove app and make sure you remove from home screen and not delete entirely off of your device. Next, if we go to settings and you just want to find right here, home screen, tap on this one, you see newly downloaded apps. So you can have it to either add to home screen or app library only. So if you have it to app library only, what it will do is when you download new applications, instead of it showing up on the home screen, it's going to show up inside the app library. Just this makes your home screen less cluttered. You can also remove existing apps on your device, not entirely off of your device, but you remove them from the home screen, but keep them on the app library. So let's say you don't want the home to be on your home screen, long press, remove app, and you see right here, remove from home screen, tap on this one, and it'll be brought to the app library. In order to bring it back to the home screen, long press the app and then drag it, and then drop it to the home screen. You can also tap on the search right here, and it will show all your applications available. You look at the side, if you just hover over, let's say you hover over P, it's gonna show all the applications which start off with P, if I go over to A, you can see A, etc. You can also use the search field, so let's search up the settings and it will show all those applications there. So really, that's all you need to know when it comes to the app library. Hopefully this video did help you out. If it did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for brand new. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.